If your leaf blower won't start, here are the nine most probable causes. Due to carbon buildup and a weakened electrode, the spark plug will degrade over time, which can prevent the leaf blower from starting. You should inspect the spark plug for damage or wear. You can also use an ignition tester to help determine if the spark plug is defective. As a general guideline, we recommend replacing the spark plug once a year. The residue that results from old fuel being left in the tank can create a restriction in the carburetor. This is why you should always use fresh fuel when filling the tank and a fuel stabilizer to help maintain the quality of the fuel. For better stability, you can use a pre-mixed fuel and oil product that is ethanol free. You can try cleaning the carburetor with carburetor cleaner to eliminate the clog. If cleaning is not effective, you can often purchase a carburetor repair kit to replace some of the components or install a new carburetor altogether. Old or bad fuel can also create a clog in the fuel filter which can prevent the leaf blower from starting. We recommend replacing the filter with a new one. If the starter's rewind spring is broken, the rope won't be able to recoil onto the pulley, resulting in the blower not starting. Many rewind springs can be replaced individually, but it may be easier to replace the whole recoil starter assembly. The recoil starter itself could be malfunctioning and unable to engage with the blower engine crankshaft. Again, the starter assembly can be replaced to solve the problem. The spark arrestor is a small screen that keeps sparks emitted by the engine from exiting the muffler. Over time, the arrestor can become clogged with soot, which may prevent the leaf blower engine from starting. You can try cleaning the arrestor with a wire brush, but you may need to replace it with a new one. A dirty air filter might prevent the leaf blower from starting as well by restricting the air coming into the carburetor. As with the spark plug, the air filter should be replaced annually or whenever it is visibly soiled. The ignition coil sends voltage to the spark plug while the engine is running. If the ignition coil is malfunctioning, the engine may not start. As with the spark plug, you can use an ignition tester to determine if the ignition coil has failed and will need to be replaced. The flywheel key is a small metal piece which fits into the crankshaft and engages with the flywheel. It is designed to break to prevent damage to the engine. Over time, the key may become worn and break on its own. If this happens, you will need to replace the flywheel key with a new one before the engine can be restarted. All of the parts shown in this video are available on our website. Be sure to enter the full model number of your product to find the specific replacement part that will fix your leaf blower.